Now that one of Colombia's popular kitchens for the homeless is closed, it's forced many to look somewhere else for dinner. For the last three years, the Salvation Army served dinner to more than 100 people daily at Ebenezer Lutheran Church. That stopped last week. The Salvation Army has moved all of its feeding services to transitions. For nearly a year, the two agencies have partnered to feed the homeless. You've hit on a problem there. There's no guarantee that some of the people that ate at Ebenezer will all come down and want to come into transitions. Craig Curry with Transitions says their goal is to get people into permanent housing through programs and outreach. His agency serves three meals a day with help from the Salvation Army to people signed up for programs Transitions offers. We haven't seen an increase because they've just stopped really Monday of this week, so it hasn't been long enough to really see a trend yet. The more we can connect volunteers with the individuals we're serving and build those relationships, the more we know that uh, we can impact people in a very positive way. Major Roger Colson with the Salvation Army says after three years at Ebenezer, it was clear that just feeding folks wasn't helping make positive changes in their lives. When you're feeding in a program like we've been able to operate at, at Ebenezer, you're really stuck in response. And we need to really get into these other areas of uh, activity if we want to see some life-changing experiences with the people we're serving. Transitions, the Salvation Army, and city leaders plan to meet on April 9th to discuss ways to feed the homeless. We reached out to the city today for their thoughts on the issue. We have yet to receive a call back. In downtown Columbia, Rob Starkey, Watch Fox News.